In a conventional workflow with an in-betweening product such as Kakany, users are required to redraw all the raster drafts with vector strokes as key frames. Meanwhile, one-to-one -one stroke correspondence between key frames should be ensured. This software provides a navigator for each stroke to guide the redrawing of a corresponding stroke in another key frame. To reduce the tedious and time-consuming manual work, we propose an automatic method. It takes as input consecutive raster key frames and a single vector image of the starting frame as a guidance and automatically generates vector drawings for the remaining key frames with one-to-one -one stroke correspondence. We call this task joint stroke tracing and correspondence. The framework also works with multiple key frames. Although trained on clean line drawing data, the framework generalizes well to rough sketches with overdrawn and uneven lines. The generated results can be imported into the in-betweening systems to produce natural in-between frames to form 2D animation. The framework is comprised of two models. First, for each stroke chain, a model finds a matching starting point in the target for tracing. Then, another model produces the corresponding vector strokes one by one. We call the first one starting point matching model. It uses a window-based processing, which crops the patches from the original images and then predicts the starting point based on the patches. Another model is called Stroke Tracing and Correspondence Model. It also uses windows to crop the patches and then predicts the stroke parameters. This workflow tends to suffer performance degradation in real cases with complex motions. In this case of starting point matching, the expected point is outside the processing window. Therefore, the prediction fails due to the limited window view. To overcome this issue, we propose an adaptive spatial transformation module which predicts a spatial transformation for the processing window in the target. With the transformed window, the cropped patch of the target is similar in content to the reference patch. The content alignment process reduces the spatial variations and provides consistent contexts to find corresponding starting points with similar spatial characteristics. The transformation is invertible and thus allows the prediction to be mapped back to coordinates of the original target image. The ASTM also works with cases in stroke tracing because the original workflow is fragile in cases with large geometric deformation. The ASTM transforms the window producing a cropped patch with aligned content that helps to predict a corresponding stroke with correct orientation. The ASTM is a plug-and-play module trained separately and can be integrated into both the starting point matching model and the stroke tracing and correspondence model. Due to the lack of a dataset with vector stroke correspondence for training, we collect one containing more than 10,000 consecutive line drawing frames and their vector drawings along with the annotation of stroke correspondence. We introduce an automatic algorithm to synthesize the data and then conduct a manual review to filter out undesired synthesis. The automatic algorithm applies an entirety level and a stroke level deformations to vector sketches to produce the corresponding frames with dynamics. This mimics the real animated frames with non-rigid motions. The vector strokes are rasterized to form raster frames. The automatic algorithm tends to induce artifacts such as unreasonable structure variation and stroke ambiguity and occlusion. We then invite 15 participants to filter out the undesired deformations. Once a deformed drawing is filtered out, a new random deformation is produced for the review. This procedure repeats until the deformation is regarded valid. Our framework works well with real animated frames with high complexity. 
the predicted vector stroke correspondence can be imported into the in-betweening product Kakini to generate in-between frames for 2D animation. It also works with multiple keyframes, dependent exclusively on the starting vector drawing. With additional simple operations in the in-betweening product, such as changing the X position, we can create more interesting 2D animations. While our approach is trained with synthetic clean line drawing images, it generalizes well to rough sketches.